over here at Brown Bagging for Kids, making sandwiches this morning. Children can't think unless they've got their tummies full, and a lot of children go to school without, with hungry tummies, and that's all they can think of. And if that's, uh, that's all they think of, then they're not thinking of school. And it's really important that they at least have one advantage in their life, and that would be a good one, to have a full tummy. Here we are at Saints. We're having a painting party. Here's some of the residents at Saints. And we're also building a shed with a hay feeder attached. So we got the guys working on that. And uh, we'll see how this goes today. Here we are at Connect Place Children's Hospice. And we're doing the Spectra Energy Transmission Helping Hands in Action Gardening Project. What will you be doing this afternoon? I'm going to be serving up some yummy lunch. It mm. smells really good. I think so. Let's all go in and check it out. All right. Yeah, I hear you. Let's go, team. Here we are on our way up to serve the community. We're at the Dr. Sun Yat Sen Classical Chinese Garden. These are Panjing, our landscapes in a tray and these stands hold the pinjing and we're in very serious need of a paint job. The Helping Hands in Action crew has done that and they are ready to go for another 20 years. So we're at Covenant House today sorting clothing for the uh, youth that stay here. This is definitely a keeper. <laughs> Standing out. We got diggers. Platters and movers. The uh, don't get in Mandy's way clip. Showing those muscles you. In that case. I, I hear you dig your work. <laughs> Hi, I'm Diane from the YWC of Calgary. And today we have a team from Spectra Energy um, preparing meals for the residents at the YWC Mary Dover House. It's really great when volunteers come in and participate with the clients and for get off since our costs at the Mary Dover House for the food that we do buy. So it's wonderful that Spectra is down today and we're very excited to have them here. Working on some invasive species removal um, management in Stanley Park with uh, volunteers from Spectra. We're just taking out some blackberry, some Himalayan blackberry. Hi! Wow! Look at that blackberry. That is huge! We're here for the HHIA for Parkway Compressor Station and we're working on the Cornerstone Daycare structure. Structure all finished. Okay, now you can wave. <laughs> now we can wave. This is the Essex County Community Living Helping Hands Project. Our project is going to be landscaping a group home in LaSalle, Ontario. This will really make this area look so much more beautiful. What a busy group. Well, this is the finished product. We have lots of grasses and shrubs, mulch on top to finish this project off. Here's our smiling group of volunteers. Look at how great they look. We got a hair out of place. We're here this morning at the Oakville Safety Village where we're going to be uh, tearing down the old frost fence and we're going to be installing a new one for the folks here. and hopefully give the perimeter of the Oakville Safety Village a new look. Okay, so here we are at the end of the day. I'm done! He is done! Today, the Helping Hands in Action group from Union Gas in Chatham will be making this school safer for all the children. Today, our group will be replacing all old standard metal hooks with new plastic safety hooks that release at a weight of 26 pounds or greater. I'm William Hanna saying just a big thank you to Union Gas for making King George the Sixth School a safer place. Okay, come on boys, you gotta work off your supper. <laughs> We're finding a way. If you hit gold, it's ours. 
Nice job there, Mr. Burton. Well, I didn't do it. I'm just helping these guys. They did all the work. Okay. Union Gas's Helping Hands is here today at Participation House helping to build a shelter. Um, we are covering the roof of the shelter with shingles today. Uh, that's just a portion of the project that we contributed to to help them and help the community. Hi, I'm Patrick Martucci. I'm here with several representatives of Union Guests Clean for Children's Safety Village, where kids get to learn about safety, such as, you know, avoiding for crossing the street and so forth. And we're here cleaning it up and, you know, just giving back to the community. Hi, this is Denise Spadato. Welcome to our Helping Hands event at the Indian Creek Road Public School. Hey guys, shouldn't we be putting the desk together upside up? <laughs> this is so much fun. This is the best way to spend your day off. <laughs> Thank you to Union Gas and all their wonderful volunteers for coming to Indian Creek Road Public School today.